Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm inviting you to come Christmas shopping with me at one of the largest Dollar Trees in the entire world. Now we've got a lot to cover, so make sure you stay along for the ride. If you're interested in checking this store out, this is located in Burlington, North Carolina. I will leave the address in the description box down below. If you visit, make sure you take a picture in front of this wonderful sign saying, Welcome to one of the largest Dollar Trees in the world. Now our first stop is going to be our garland section. They have lots to choose from this year and it looks like each piece is about 9 feet long. Lots and lots to choose from. Now for this video, I'm going to be talking a lot more than I normally do. I got a lot of complaints that I don't talk in my videos and that I go way too fast. So in this video, you're going to hear me talking a lot more and you're going to see lots of slow images like you're seeing now. So right now we're just looking at some door hangers. They have lots to choose from. And this is our second option of garland. Our other one was only 9 feet and this one is 50 feet. We have tons of ornaments to choose from. These are really small ornaments that you can find um, in pretty much all of the Dollar Trees that I've been to. And these are going to fit on our smaller trees if you can find any because they're basically sold out everywhere. Now you'll see in a lot of these door signs and wood pieces that they're very vintage like this sled. I absolutely love it. Looks like it's wood grain. It's amazing. And these little door tags, there's so many options for crafts. I've seen a lot of people paint over them and then write joy in big letters. Uh, lots of options to do with these signs or just keep them as they are. This one was a little creepy, but it is just a dollar. Now like I said, tons and tons of things to choose from and a lot of people take these little wood blocks and cover over them with some paint and then add their own little spin on it. Um, I really love these signs. I think the glitter is popping as you can see. It's almost blinding. It's pretty amazing. on making a wreath this year I highly suggest checking out Dollar Tree they have all wreath materials that you will need and they have some really amazing Christmas bows as you can see lots of designs to choose from and they're very very big Make sure to check out my 10 DIY from Dollar Tree to see how I use these window clings in many DIY projects. I got a little bit of hate with my ornament section last video. 
not my fault. I can't help that these ornaments are flying off the shelves. So if you do get a chance to get into your Dollar Tree soon, I highly suggest doing it soon because a lot of the ornaments are literally flying off the shelves. So go very, very soon. If you have a gnome obsession and you're on a tight budget, Dollar Tree is perfect for you. These adorable gnomes that are 14 inches tall are just a dollar. I fell in love with this little mailbox. I thought it would be perfect for school aged children to hold any goodies at their Christmas party at school that their teacher or other students might hand out. Um, very cute. It also comes in a metal tin version as well and a couple different designs. The balloon section was also a really cool find. They had Merry, they had Christmas, Happy, and New Year. They are pretty big just for a dollar, so I thought it was pretty awesome. I'm pretty sure all of them come in several colors as well, so if you don't want a green Merry, it also comes in red. If you're looking for some inspiration for stocking stuffers for your kids, Dollar Tree has an amazing selection for young kids. There's so many plush animals to choose from this year. There's lots of games, there's stickers, there's coloring books, and tons and tons of candy. I highly suggest checking out this section this year. 
One of my favorite finds this year at Dollar Tree are definitely the treat bags. There are so many options to choose from, not just with the designs, but the actual bags themselves. We have Ziploc bags and we have ties. They also have some cookie boxes that you'll see in just a little bit. They are so, so cute for baked goods or if you're making wax melts. Another favorite find are these tin boxes. There are so many designs and so many different sizes. There's some that have little windows so you can see what's inside or like these where they're completely closed off but have adorable little sayings. They also have some wooden boxes and some cardboard. Um, there are things that are perfect for cookies or things that you make like I do I make these angel wing ornaments that fit perfectly in these little tin boxes and are perfect for keepsakes. Dollar Tree has definitely stepped up their game in their stockings this year. They have these cute little mini stockings that come in a two pack which is perfect for teachers giving away little goodies for their kids at their Christmas parties. Now on to the big stockings. The huge one this year and probably for years to come is the buffalo plaid with the faux fur. If you stumble across any of those, please get them because they sell out super, super fast. This year they also have these really cute stocking holders that has little weight so it doesn't fall over. They come in an elf, a snowman, and Santa. Now they have really good ones this year like unicorns that I have never seen before and more later on. I really like this one that I think is also really great for teachers or if you as a parent want to give to your child so they can color them themselves. I think this one is really cute. The elf made me do it and have a holly jolly Christmas just goes along with the vintage theme this year that Dollar Tree has. Dollar Tree also has a lot of character stockings. We have a lot with Disney, so we have Minnie and Mickey. We have the Minions, there's Frozen, and then we also have some DC and Marvel characters on the bottom. Lots to choose from for your kids this year. Super, super cute, really great designs, and pretty great quality as well. You can't forget a stocking for your fur friends. So we have a cat and we also have a dog stocking. I really like this dog one. I also have it at my house and you can personalize it by putting their names on the ears.
pretty great selection of do-it-yourself crafts for kids, paint your own ornaments, color your own stockings, and many, many more. We have lots of ornaments that you can make. They have plain ones and things to fill them with. Um, I think this section is pretty great for teachers. So if you're a teacher, I think this is really great to decorate your classroom for Christmas. Um, have some little games for the kids or if you're kindergarten or below, I think it's really great to have those to put the kids' names on it just to make them feel at home in your classroom. Another great find this year are these adorable little nutcrackers. I put one in a glass jar that I got from Dollar Tree and thought it looked amazing. Dollar Tree has a great selection on their gift wrapping paper this year. Lots of things from Pixar and Disney. So if you are a fan of these or you have little kids, this is a great option to stay on the cheap side and still give them what they want. Now we're going to head over to the kids toy section. I think this is another really great DIY that you can do. They have these little characters that are on stands and you can find these DIY snow globes where these characters fit perfectly in the snow globe and you can make your own character snow globe this year by adding some water or just some faux snow. There's so many characters to choose from, things from Toy Story, Hey Arnold, Paw Patrol, and Mickey Mouse. great gift option this year are these zodiac sign candles. They have all the zodiac signs this year. They have a great fragrance and they're just really, really cute. So I think this is a great gift option. I think this next thing is going to fly off the shelf. So make sure if you find a cinnamon broom in your store, you grab two. Next, we're going to talk about our huge crafter square at this Dollar Tree. They sell things like Mod Podge, lots of canvases, and tons of wood blanks. They have a lot of materials that a lot of Dollar Trees I've gone to do not have, so I think if you get a chance to check this Dollar Tree out, you definitely need to. I found some really good finds in this Crafter Square. I thought this Scraft Utility knife set was really great. Next is the mini glass containers that literally fly off the shelf, so if you ever find them, make sure you grab a couple.
I really think the craft clamps are really great to have on hand. These bottles are really hard to find and some more mini glass containers. These are a hard top. They don't have the cork top like I like. There's lots of crafts that you can do with a cork top. So if you do find them, make sure you grab them. This year they have a lot of selections for their yarn. Tons of different colors to choose from. So make sure you grab a couple of those as well. I really enjoy these chalkboard signs. This one comes with a stand. I think this is perfect for a Wi-Fi password or for table signs at a wedding. I thought this one with its own stand would be great for a Christmas countdown. And these chalkboard tags I think would be really great for a small business or for someone just writing their name for a Christmas present. Dollar Tree has an amazing book selection and this trip I found lots of cookbooks. As you saw that price tag was $12.99. A lot of big name bookstores can't sell all their books so they give them to Dollar Tree and they're only a dollar. I think this is a great gift option if you're on a budget because everyone loves a good cookbook. Christmas Village is definitely one of my favorites this year. I love the bottle brush trees. They come in white, they come in green, and they also have mini bottle brush trees as well. The little scenes that they have are really cute this year. They have many to choose from, lots of families, Santa Claus and snowmen, and they brought a red truck and a camper this year. They have this faux snow to lay out on a mantle, and we have our cobblestone corners. These are miniature houses, bakeries, churches, general store, and post office. They are super cute, and they also have a light, so you can put them on your mantle and have them super, super cute this year. If you're getting married this year, I highly suggest checking out the wedding section at Dollar Tree. They have these adorable little frames that can be used as table signs so your guests know which table they need to go. They obviously have tons of frames to choose from in different designs and different sizes. You can't go wrong. I think one of the most sleeped on areas of Dollar Tree is our baking section. There's so many materials that you need for baking and they can all be found at Dollar Tree. So if you're cooking this year, I think you should definitely check out this section because they have so many things to choose from. Another great stocking stuffer idea, especially for our teenage girls, is this huge selection of LA Colors makeup at Dollar Tree. They had a whole selection of just LA Colors, anything from eyeliner to mascara primer, and some fake eyelashes. So don't sleep on this, make sure you check it out guys. As always, I'm loving Dollar Tree's travel mug designs. I really like the gnome for holidays, of course I'm big on the gnomes. But I think this would be a really cute gift option, especially if you are on a budget or if you just need something really quick for a dirty Santa gift. And these holiday mugs are perfect for a gift as well. And last but certainly not least is our huge section of candy for Christmas. There are so many things to choose from this year. Absolutely insane. My personal favorite is this peppermint crunch kettle corn. It is to die for. I swear by it. So if you find it in your store, please check it out and let me know what you think.
really cool find this year is the peppermint candy shot glass or just glass depending on who is gifting it. Something really fun to find. They also have peppermint spoons and chocolate spoons as well. Another great find is this Rudolph snack mix. They come in two different pouches, the red and the blue. They are really hard to find sometimes, so if you do find them in your store, please get a couple of packs because they are delicious. Okay guys, that is it. Thank you so much for joining me on this shopping trip at one of the largest Dollar Trees in the world. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time.